what he's thinking. Oh my god, okay. All these guys want to fuck me in the ass. This is bad. They all want my body. God damn it, why am I so sexy? No. I'm gonna have to fight them off one by one. Where the fuck is this self-confidence coming from? You see the same straight guy trying to hit on a girl, and it's this. Should I talk to her? I don't know. If I do talk to her, what should I say? Should I ask her right away? I don't know. She's giving me weird looks. I don't know. This, this feels wrong. What the? The guy's got nothing going on. There's no self-confidence. Can you imagine taking the homophobic self-confidence and applying it to hitting on chicks? You walk into a club, there's a hundred girls. <sighs> oh my god. <laughs> oh. hundred girls want to have sex with me. Oh, this is going to be a long night. God damn it, why am I so sexy? Girl comes up, just says hello. All right, let's chill. Let's fucking chill out. Do you want to blow me here? Are we going to the bathroom? What's going on? Whatever we do, do it quickly because 99 other chicks want to fuck me. Chill. But like, what about other situations in life? Just apply it to anything. What about a job interview? You know how nervous people get before a job interview? Just pretend it's a gay bar. <laughs> Just see people walking in, kicking down the door. Psh! Listen up, motherfuckers. I know you want to give me the job. I know you want to give me a million dollar signing bonus. You over there, you want to suck my cock. You want to lick my asshole. But let's just sign this quickly because the sexual tension in here is making me very, very uncomfortable. You wouldn't get the job, but you would be remembered. And as we all know in the corporate world, networking is everything. Thank you very much. You've been a wonderful audience.